Today's video I wanted to talk about color theory. Color theory is the study of how colors interact with each other and how they can be combined to create pleasing visual effects. The basic elements of color theory include uh, hue, saturation, and brightness. It's used in a variety of fields from art and design to marketing and advertising. Color theory is essential for makeup artists as it helps us to understand the color wheel, color harmonies, and how to mix and match colors for different skin tones and makeup looks. A color wheel shows the relationship between colors. It typically includes primary, secondary, and tertiary colors, as well as complementary and analogous color schemes. The color wheel in makeup is a tool used in helping selecting complementary colors that work well together. By using the color wheel, you can create a variety of makeup looks that are visually appealing and balanced. The color wheel is mapped out with primary colors of red, yellow, and blue and are evenly spaced around the wheel. Secondary colors such as orange, green, and purple are made by mixing two primary colors. Tertiary colors like red, orange, or blue, green are created by mixing primary colors with one secondary. Primary colors red, blue, and yellow are used in makeup to create a wide range of colors. By mixing them together, they are commonly used in color correcting products to neutralize certain skin tones such as green to counteract redness. Secondary colors such as green, purple, and orange are often used in makeup to create various shades and tones. For example, purple can be used to brighten the complexion and orange can be used to correct the under eye circles. Tertiary colors are created by mixing primary and secondary colors. In makeup, they can be used to create more complex shades and add depth and dimension to a look. For example, mixing a primary red with a secondary green can create a tertiary brown, which can be used for contouring or to add warmth to the face. Complementary colors are used in makeup to either create contrast or neutralize the skin tone. Some common examples are green, which is used to neutralize redness, while orange is used to neutralize dark spots and under eyes. Complementary colors can be used to create bold and dramatic makeup looks. Analogous colors are colors that are next to each other on the color wheel, and they are often used in makeup to create a harmonious and cohesive look. Using analogous colors can help to enhance the natural features of the face and create a more balanced and polished appearance. For example, using shades of pink and orange together can create a warm and flattering look for those with neutral or warm skin tones. Color theory is an essential aspect of makeup artistry. Don't be afraid to experiment with different colors and shades to find what works best for you. Remember, makeup is all about self-expression. So that was color theory. I hope you found this video informative. I know when I need a refresher, I like to reread uh, Kate Middleton color theory for the makeup artist. If you want a more in-depth understanding of color theory, this is the book for you. I also went ahead and listed all my go-to resources on color theory down in the description box. If I missed anything, be sure to leave me a comment. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next.